game. It was a tough game, but um, you know, Coach Spencer and the other coaches had a good game plan, and uh, we you know came out with a win, so it was good. Then another bye week. What's your what's your priority and what's your defense's priority going into this one? Um, big priority. Um, Probably just working on mistakes. You know, we gave up too many big plays. That's a huge thing that we need to work on. You know, and especially a few times they just pounded the ball on us all the way down to the goal line. So um, there's there's a lot of things we need to work on. But um, getting everyone healthy and you know working on eliminating big plays and we should you know be pretty excited about playing this year. With, with a running quarterback like Sam's, how, how much importance is it on, on you guys at the linebacker position to to maintain him from running it, but also you know being part of that that uh, pass defense. <coughs> Uh, when you play a running quarterback like that, it's, it's a lot harder just because you know it, they've got one extra guy. So um, you know it, it's all about knowing who's got their job and, and kind of keeping them in the pocket. You know, it, it, you know the more he can scramble around, it's harder on our corners. So it, it's important for the D line, the linebackers, to, to contain him, force him to throw the ball quick, uh, get the ball out of his hands. So it, it's definitely more of a challenge with quarterbacks like that. But um, you know we're going to see a lot of it. So we just got, it's something we need to work on. And then, I mean, two linebackers come up with, with interceptions today. I mean, how, how, how big is that for, for you and Sean? Uh, you know, it was pretty exciting. Um, you know, I, I was jumping up. I was going crazy for every single interception. So, I mean, it, it was good to get a pick. Um, see Sean, D'Lo, uh, you get a fumble recovery. Uh, those those turnovers are essential to winning games, getting the ball back to our offense and giving them opportunities. So it, it was very exciting. It's a momentum changer, and, and that's something that we need to change. That We had a lot of success in 2011 with turnovers, and, you know, we just need to get that ball rolling and start getting more. Got five in the second half, Caleb, all in the second half of this game. And I won't I won't say is it frustrating, but are you guys feeling as you watch your offense go, like, okay, we, we really need to force some turnovers now the last couple of weeks? Yeah, well, I mean, it, it, it's our job as a defense to do turnovers. You know, it, it, it's I think I think it, we've got a lot of older guys on defense, so we know you know it's not our job to worry about the offense. Whether we're winning, losing, tied, we have the same job: get the ball back, stop the stop the opposing offense, and create turnovers. So, um, you know, it, it, it's not frustrating. You know, we, we have plenty of faith in our offense, and we just know what our job is, and we keep on grinding. We get excitement, we get emotion from the crowd, and you know, we, we just we have a lot of fun out there. What was the attitude of this team? Because you were jolted last week, I'm sure, just by losing. So was this about the response you expected? Are you happy with the response a week after what happened at West Virginia? Oh, yes, sir. You know, one of the good things is on our defense and our offense is we have a lot of older leadership. We've got a lot of older guys. So it wasn't hard to rally the troops, get the younger guys on board and get excited. You know, we had a came into this game with a chip on our shoulder, ready to prove ourselves, you know, um, and I think we did that. You know, we just need to continue to work. we got to take advantage of this. Uh, bye week, work on turnovers and um, get the right uh, mindset for TCU.